Hello, my name is Björn Rentemeister from Infineon Technology. Today I would like to introduce our new XHP module. It's called um, XHP, so the um, opening of the answer, which we have introduced to the market about one year ago. Today I would like to present our high power, high voltage module. So this package is coming in 3.3 kV, 4.5 kV and 6.5 kV. The first one will be a 3.3 device with 450 amps. The device is coming in a half bridge configuration. So all the devices which we have will be a half bridge. Also for the other voltage classes, that means that we have the first half bridge available in 4.5 kV and 6.5 kV on the market. Also the 3.3 kV this time is a real half bridge before we had in our portfolio just double switches. This device is only one device of which can be parallel to higher currents. So that means that we have one device with 450 amps and by paralleling them, you can reach higher current densities. The total current density of that device is about 17% higher compared to what we have in our portfolio today. So we have an extension of the power density. And the new thing with this package is that we have separated the DC terminals from the AC terminals. By doing this, we force the application to go to a more symmetric um, configuration, which means that we can lower the strain inductance dramatically. So in total, this means that we, when we compare it with the existing packages today, we can lower the strain inductance by a factor of six. The device itself, um, has, yeah, as I said, the separated DC and AC terminals and it offers the possibility to mount a driver board in the middle of the package. And these on the side you find these little hooks. These hooks are uh, uh, made to parallel them very easily and connect them mechanically. The device itself is available as early prototype, so please contact our uh, distribution team from EBV and uh, the planned start of production of this device in 3.3 kV is in Q4 2016. Good morning, I'm Dr. Raghavan Nagarajan from Infineon Technologies. Here today I'm introducing you IGBD5.xt in a prime pack package. What you see here in this first module is an IGBD5.xt in a prime pack 3 plus package having a current rating of 1800 amperes at 1700 volt and in a prime pack 2 package having 1200 ampere 1200 volt in this new technology we have the, what do you call a new igbd generation chip and a dot xt having a copper metallization and copper bonding uh, what we have uh, to show the benefit of igbd5.xt technology we have used this in a demonstrator where the demonstrator was previously having an IGBT4 prime pack that was replaced by an IGBT5.xt prime pack of 1800 amperes and only the module adapter board was modified, nothing else was modified and with that we are able to get 30% increase in output current without any other changes. This is a much benefit to the customer. The customer is having two options, either to increase the lifetime or increasing the output power. He can choose between these two axes or anything in between this. That is the real benefit of having IGBD5 and .xt technology. Thank you.